Yakuza. <laughs> hey, bestseller. Looking good. Well, no shit. What gave me away? What, the see-through thing? I'm a figment of your imagination. Just like pretty much everything else you see here. Maybe even you. Yeah, you're right. Everything that happened before made perfect sense, but this is insane. Good catch, Al. The GPS, yeah, I know. Follow the signal. Got it. Anyway, if this is insane, and it's all from your mind, what's that say about you? <laughs> oh, come on. Don't shit a shitter, Al. Deep down, you're always happy to see me. Can't lie to yourself, know what I'm saying? You? No, really? And I always thought you went out of your way to avoid trouble. So, anywho, I'm here to help you out, pal. The thing is, you need to get a grip, alright? Well, hey, you know, be fair. It's not my fault you think I'm annoying. Al, baby, relax, it's cool. Just try to stay on the ball here. You need to do what Zane tells you. He's been here for ages. He's like the expert. Yeah, that'd be the Biltmore Sawmill. I don't know anything you don't. So why don't you ask yourself that? Huh? Maybe you saw a sign for it back in the real world. Or maybe it's the sawmill, because I said it's the sawmill, and now you can't get it out of your head. Yeah, sure has given me a headache. Or is that your headache? Do you have a headache? Dude, we're bonding. Oh, jeez. I'm glad I'm not really here. These guys are spooky as hell. Hey. I bet we can get some light here if you nail the right word. Better be careful, though. Al, come on. You gotta be careful. Those are bad words. <laughs> bad words. Nice. What do you want from me? You're the guy with the flashlight. Woo, mama. Hey, Al, I guess the pen is mightier, th mightier than the sword. Aw. You know, you're gonna have to make your way across here. I'm thinking the solution probably has something to do with those words. Yeah, you should probably use them. Ha, oh, I know. Ah, see, this is the way things should be. I give advice and you follow. That's when things go right. When you get up to something on your own, that's when the trouble starts. Uh, Al, I'm not saying anything you haven't come up with first. Figment, remember? No, this is great. And it's probably therapeutic for you, too. Okay, this is just too weird. You're weird. That's just the way this place is, Al. All that random stuff in your head? Imagination can be the enemy here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what, Al? Do yourself a favor, and don't pursue that train of thought any further. You need to get that door open before you can get into the warehouse. That's the way forward. Because you're a complicated man, and no one understands you. But I'm talking... It's a demolition derby! Al, it's a demolition derby! A death rally! <laughs> oh, oh, that's crazy! Make sure you don't bite your tongue, Al! <laughs> Al, you drive like a maniac! I hope you're wearing your seatbelt, Al! Oh! That one is going right to the great junkyard in the sky! <laughs> <laughs> Coming through! Oh, that's never a good sound, is it? I think the dust in this place is setting off my allergies. Well, my allergies are definitely here. Achoo! See? Allergies. Whoa, that's fast! Guess you gotta run, Al. That looks crazy dangerous, Al. Well, you're gonna have to find your way out of there. I'll wait. Just remember, you're still in the dark place. You know that, right? I don't want to alarm you, pal, but it's sink or swim time. Al, did you notice that light? Might be useful. I think you gotta swing it. Hey, nice job, Al. So, you really are nuts, huh? Let's face it, we always knew this was coming. Crazy people don't know they're crazy. That's where they're crazy. Hey, check out the light show behind the lodge. Yeah, you're done sinking now. That means he's just about caught up with you. You better go talk to him. Lots of fireworks here. Nice. Oh, hell yeah. Remember this, Al? Hey, isn't it kind of ironic that you're a writer and you're threatened by your own imagination? It's like your greatest power turned against you. Jeez, 
always with the melodrama. You can get inside now, Al. The big guy busted down the door. Whoa. See, Al? This is classic you. Always making things complicated. Even your memories are complicated. Uh, yeah. So, I guess you're gonna need to talk to Zane out there now that he's actually here. I'm just gonna, you know, let you non-imaginary people talk in peace. Nah, that was a crutch, you know. Hey, you're moving up in the world, buddy. Hey, Al. <sighs> Feeling kind of depressed here. So Zane's your new buddy now. I feel abandoned. That doesn't mean I don't have any feelings. Thing is, you need to get all rational here. Abandon your fantasies, right? Well, I kind of hate to say this, pal, but I'm one. Al, what I'm saying is the only way you're getting in that cabin is through me. It's one of those kill your darlings things. But hell, you're used to that, big shot writer. Am I right? What does it say about you when you're this desperate to keep yourself from getting better? Here we go! I'm earning the 15% commission! It's great that you first make yourself an imaginary friend, and then you, you can't even get along with that guy! People skills, Al! You're a master! And it's not just that! You're a modern master of crime fiction, an expert on murder in dark alleyways, and a master of substance abuse. That's the best part! Hell, it's great that my job mostly consists of making sure you don't ruin your entire life because you have all the impulse control of a pit bull on crack. It's very enriching. I have several lawyers on speed dial just because I never know when you get in trouble again. You know what kind of people need that? Gangsters and assholes. And you're not, not a gangster. Because they make money all the time. Hey, remember when you threw a hissy fit? Because your wife tried to help you and your ego couldn't take it? And because of that, you almost got me killed a dozen times over? BFF, Al! BFF! It's totally not pathetic that you have to literally pay your best friend to hang out with you because everybody else refuses to put up with your surly ass.